story time. Did I almost get sex trafficked? Or at the very least, taken? I was in Target the other day and there was definitely someone following me. It was really weird. And it was a woman. She was like right on me. There were a few aisles and I would turn and then every time I turned around, she was behind me. Super weird. I wasn't really too nervous because I was like, Shh, I could take this bitch. I just come from the barn. So I was wearing boots and I was wearing spurs. I was wearing all black. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of look like a badass. I don't think I would have fucked with me. But this woman was definitely following me. I went to check out and then all of a sudden I turned around while I was checking out and she was right there. It looked like she was looking for me. They were really busy of course because Target is always understaffed and never has enough people at the checkout. So she went to Starbucks to pay. I definitely noticed that and I could tell you what she was wearing. She was wearing a white shirt like a red and black plaid purse with red pants she was just super shady i'm watching her and i parked around the side of our target not in like the main parking lot and she lost track of me so i went to my car and i unloaded all my stuff and i had been able to ditch her by then she made me really nervous i just had this weird feeling here's the strange thing like we were testing out our apple air tags because i'm leaving on a trip soon and i have a fear of something happening to me. We have a kidnapping in our family history. So it's been something that's been like bred into me over the years. So it's funny because I was already wearing this Apple AirTag and it's, it's odd because my husband was actually tracking me at the moment to test it out and make sure it would work when I left the country. So that was funny. I look back over at the other parking lot and I see her like frantically turning around and looking for somebody, presumably me. I see her like fumbling for her phone. I didn't see, ever see anybody else around. So this all could have just been a weird, creepy coincidence. It definitely could have been. Because of everything I've seen on TikTok, I did a scan around my car. I walked all the way around my car and made sure there was nothing attached to it, none of those zip ties, nothing stuck in the door handles, nothing. And there wasn't anything. I hopped in my car, I locked my doors, left out of the back entrance instead of the main entrance, and I pretty much took back roads all the way home. It really didn't freak me out that much, but it was definitely something I was thinking about and noticing, so I don't really know what happened there, but be careful out there. Uh, it made me pause and think. I'm a badass, but are you? Could you take someone like that? I could have taken her. But if she had drugged me, I, you know, that's it. As a follow-up, I do want to say I'm 45 and my husband has me convinced that no one wants me, no one will sex traffic me because I am too old. <laughs>